Yo, what am I, Shadow? Army, so does I, Shadow Critics, back again with another Zentman anime manga review video. So, yes, um, recently I was halfway done with the manga chapters of Zentman. Uh, I stopped reading it not too long ago because I, I just lost interest in reading the manga. Because, honestly, I prefer the anime over the manga, honestly. And, and there's something I'm kind of pissed that something did not add in or mention it in the anime. Like, showing more tits or anything like that. And there was a sex scene in it. And show how brutal and gory it was. And... The story was dragged on a bit too long, and they add things, something never mentioned in the anime. They changed something based on, oh, actually, anime, anime changed something based on the manga. Like, something should be in anime, but decided to cut it off and change it. So, yeah, I. The rest just feel like the same the anime that I watch but only thing that had never been in it or mentioned or some of them had been changed because of the anime changed what it was based in the manga or some shit and there's one thing I I did not like uh, the volume which I forget which volume was I think it was volume 3 4 or 5 I can't remember where the freaking rich boy whatever his damn name is you know, meet his first big villain, and he confronts him way earlier in the manga volume. Way earlier, and I feel like it was about to be the end of the series on the manga, which I did not like. I prefer the anime version because the anime, when it told his story arc about his big villain, when close to the end of the anime series, was perfect. That's how it should be. But now they decided to do it way earlier in the manga version. And the one thing I didn't know what had happened when all the girls get killed, he loses an arm. Losing an actual hand, like half of his arm. Or or just the hand in general. That didn't happen in the anime. It happened in the manga, which I didn't know. So yeah. And I'm kind of pissed that never happened in the anime. But at the same time, I just didn't care. And I couldn't relate with the characters in the manga. And I only watched Zetman like, what, once or twice? Like, almost a year ago, I think. And I don't feel like watch, you know, rewatching it again. So, pretty much, I'm not going to keep reading the manga or rewatching the anime. So that means I am not going to do the what if, uh, what if Akia Fudo was that man. So I'm pretty much not going to do that. I know that was supposed to be 1k, but since you guys was like on a roll and didn't give me no time to finish what I was doing, and I lost interest in reading, continuing with the manga, and the idea of me and my homie Boss Fiend came up, it would be too difficult and to you know, go on and explain the, the full story. The part would be, would be like, I don't know, like two hours long for each part, or how I many parts would be just be too long in general because of the manga. So, yeah, I'd rather not do that because I have other what ifs that I have going on right now, and so pretty much I haven't started doing them yet and it's gonna be difficult so yeah the 8k special is not gonna happen I'm sorry guys it's probably not gonna happen at all but don't get me wrong I did enjoy reading it so far it was good but I just couldn't relate with the character in the manga because I prefer the anime over the manga because keep this in mind I grew up watching anime never grew up reading the manga I prefer the mo I prefer the anime over the manga in my personal opinion
That's the reason why I don't even add or even mention base of the manga for each of my what ifs. Just using for only anime um, for for each what ifs because it's too difficult to memorize everything for what ifs. So I pretty much prefer not to mention it or bringing it up, just only mentioning or bringing up based from the show. So I might do a video about why I prefer this the show over the manga or something like that but it probably won't be a good video because I just said it because I prefer the anime over the manga because I grew up the show but didn't grow up with the manga reading it honestly so because I didn't know what manga was at the time because I grew up watching the anime so yeah that's my reason why I never read much of the manga but I am starting reading some there's some mangas that had caught my attention. There's been mangas that I've been highly recommended that I've been told. So, yeah, that's pretty much my reasoning. And I, so pretty much I'm not gonna do that. What if? Sorry, everybody. So, yeah, uh, hope you guys can understand. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Links to my social media. All that will be down below. Scratch your you guys know the drill. Again, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Yeah, before, shout out to Critias. I'll see you guys later.